what I call life. Hi everyone, I'm gonna do 24 hours vlogging in English. I usually do it in French. Comme vous le savez, don't judge the accent. Ne jugez pas l'accent. I've been in the UK for eight years, haven't lost the accent. I cringe when I hear other French accents, but I feel in myself, I'm convinced that I've got a very British accent, which is obviously not the case, because anytime I meet someone, they're like, so you're French, and I'm like, how did you know? Anyway, start of the day, we're in Athens where I just moved a month ago, two months ago, and we're gonna spend the day together. It's now 8 a.m. and I'm taking the bins out as I'm going to El Gimnasio. It's so handy because my gym is literally four minutes away from my flat, which I love and which was a requirement of where I would live because in London as well, I had my gym like four minutes away and it gives me no excuse not to hit the gym every single morning. I am a slug, okay? I'm a snail, a big snail. So I go to the gym literally for a 30 minute goal. I do the 12-3-30 routine by Lauren Giraldo, which is like a treadmill routine. Anyway, I just wanted to show my my look. And welcome to my street. I live in a neighborhood called Calitea, which is right in the center, but not totally center. But I love it because it's everything next to here. I've got cafes, I've got bars. Everything is pretty much around mine. For those who don't know me, I'm Anna L and I'm a fashion stylist. I usually live in London, but I've decided to move to Athens for God knows how long. Because I literally thought I would come for three months and I've been two months here. And things took a very unexpected twist, meaning I've met some friends, I've met some very good friends, I'm living with a dog, I really love my flat and stuff. Yesterday I had a job offer in London, and well, a job interview, and I thought, oh, I would love to get the job, and then I thought, oh shit, if I get the job, that means I need to go back to London, and you know, like, it's almost December, and it's like 22 degrees right now, it's 8 a.m., like, this is where I'm living with this life. Literally why I'm on this earth, to live for this kind of life. At the gym, so to give you an idea, for six months I pay like 39 euros for six months, which is a fucking joke. When you told me that, I was like, that's per month. And even per month, that wouldn't be very expensive because that's like a four floors gym. And it's honestly so good. Classes included and stuff, so that's my floor. In Greece, they love to fucking stare. They love to stare. And sometimes it's flattering, sometimes it's a bit like, Ugh, stop staring. The thing I do is I stretch and then I do my routine. And I might take some weight and for the first time of my life do some weight. Well, not for the first time, but like for the second time. They're kind of like next to me, so I have no excuse. It's kind of a sign from the universe that I need to do it. After the gym, what I do is I head to a coffee called Grinch, which is at the end of the road. And there, you're gonna get impressed with my Greek skills. Calimera. Medrillo. It's fine. Brown sugar. This is my every single morning highlight. I love this so fucking much and it's just like coffee powder and I don't know what the f*** else they put inside but it's very foamy and it's super nice. And it's like one euro compared with UK four pounds coffee. And this is where we're heading. The dog ate my glasses. So I need new ones. And this is the beast. The beast. Elle me donne de l'amour, ça va, c'est pas. Non, Donc, 
it's a beautiful beautiful day today in Athens right now it's like 24 degrees we're gonna go explore and I'll show you the look composed of my pyjama little black skirt actually a skirt and just some sandals and just applied some uh, sunscreen but i thought i wouldn't make you guys be too jealous so i did not show this part of my of my of my day sunscreen is needed in november when you live in athens i'm gonna head to a neighborhood called uh, kukaki kukaki is a very very cute neighborhood i've only been once twice and I feel I always do the exact same neighborhood like Cintiq Mine stuff and I feel like today is Saturday I've got my whole day so I'm gonna go there there is a, a place called uh, Tree Books which is a very cute library and a cafe at the same time so I'd love to be a little bit of that girl that girl sit down there with my book right now I'm kind of like seeing a guy who is really into books and I'm really into books as well but what I didn't say is that I'm into like romantic stuff you know like more like easy stuff and he's into like Camus, Hemingway and stuff so he gave me a book and I'm gonna read it to pretend I I'm a clever girl I actually started the book yesterday and funnily enough on the first page there is a message from his ex-girlfriend saying love you hope you enjoy the book and I'm like Surely you saw that. Surely you remember that when you gave me that book. Anyway. p.m. and I got myself some takeaway because I was supposed to go to the restaurant with my flatmate but then I lasted a long time because I really like walking so I literally walked around Kukaki for like I don't know two hours or something so he left he left I arrived it's called a daco salad and it's like bread like cretan bread like rust bread with tomatoes olives feta and they added some uh, cap I don't know how you say this in English and then I got myself a little chicken skewer a chicken stick but they cook the chicken so well here so yeah I'm very hungry and I'm gonna watch an episode of girls later we're gonna go out with my girlfriends we decided to go for a fun night and to do something a bit unusual and we decided to do karaoke night and I haven't done karaoke in I mean I've done it basically once in my life so it's gonna be it's promising it's gonna be fun so funny because I vlog in French usually and I feel like now I'm vlogging in English my English or like Anna personality is getting out like usually I'm Anael and I'm all like vulnerable and stuff and then whenever I speak in English it's like another face is on which is fun it's called being a Gemini as well that's uh, that's what it is flats in Greece sorry they are not furnished so you literally need to buy everything and when you have to buy everything you're fucking broke like I am now and so you literally so anyway, after I met my friends uh, Laura and Faith and went uh, for a drink in a Spanish or Cuban, I think, bar and it's so fun because basically everyone dances in the street and it's so much fun, it's such a good atmosphere. <laughs> And then after that, we went to this karaoke bar and we decided to perform a quite unusual song. We discovered we had the same weird taste in music. Not that System of a Down is weird, but anyway, this is the performance. Enjoy! Now, 